Ah yes, SS-13. The peak of gaming for like 300 people. Right, so colonial marines factions. The marines. I have to say these humans put to shame even the mongrel dogs of the empire. The level of incompetency and straight griefing I've witnessed come from these stains of life is astonishing and quite intoxicating. Marines are grabbed by the throat and told to work together or die, but in reality squishing 30 people together, and with most of them having non-IFF weapons, turns into a truly tormenting experience. Adding on to torment, playing medic during high pop rounds is asking for an aneurysm. You'll either get pushed while defibbing a corpse pile of seven dudes or be stuck in the chemistry line for 40 minutes. Engineer would be fun if you were more like a house Telvani wizard in being able to conjure great defenses out of sheer will alone, instead of waiting for metal to be sent down by your deaf cargo staff, if you happen to somehow get the specialist class. I congratulate you, but while I was congratulating you, the demolitionist token has already been taken. Sorry. You have to pick one of the other inferior kits. Good luck. All in all, I would recommend playing Marine since it's super easy and witnessing the shipside shenanigans is always glorious. Next faction. The Xenomorphs. These creatures repulse me. Probably because they remind me of Argonians since they are both covered in scales. And that they are all slaves following orders from their master. Anyways, if you want to be berated and banished by a 400-hour Prime Empress Queen for not moving to the location they want you to be in 0.1 seconds, then be my guest. In fairness, playing the ambush cast can be really fun due to backlining the Marines and killing slash taking captures for your hive. Also, frenzy drone rocks. Next faction. The Hunters faction, aka the Predators, are probably the worst faction in the game. Why? All these bozos do 80% of the time is watch from afar like glorified observer mains. These people write sprawling texts about their character and how big their muscles are and what false god they worship. All of this power they have, like max stats, strong weapons, unlimited cloak, and alpha male height, and they can't even get an alpha private to talk to them. The marines are so busy fear arping that trying to duel anyone is a waste of time. Even if a predator gets a duel, it's probably going to be Pierce Jackson, or Jonathan Hogg, or another one of their alt accounts that instantly deletes them with AP rifle rounds. These guys are cringe, but I do like their masks. Next faction, please. Okay, so these other factions aren't really important, so I'm just going to speed through them. The UPP, they have cool war cry emotes, plus better skills than the Marines. They have that communist agenda, which is kind of lame, because why would you share things together with one another when you could just give me everything instead? Don't expect to play these guys that much since you only really can roll them as an ERT response or one of those capitalist oil-wet fantasies events that the admins do during the weekends. Next one, the CLF. This faction is just a you-get-to-kill-anyone-and-anything card, though good luck killing anything as CLF since you will almost always be outnumbered and under-equipped. Most of the roles of the CLF have good skills, though, so you can use those to your advantage. Next faction, PMCs. The PMCs are just a bunch of corporate chills that have fancy white gear and guns. You will usually only see them as a marine bullying the fuck out of the research department for some classified reagents or dead on the floor because the marine smart gunner forgot that they don't have IFF. Next faction, survivors. Bruh, do I even need to talk about these guys? The odds of seeing any of these power gamers alive when landing as a marine is next to none. The only good aspect to the game they offer is for something that xenomorphs can kill before marines come. Their skills and equipment got mega nerfed recently, so I don't see the point of anyone playing this role unless they are a masochist.